Okay. That's a lot better. <laughs> okay. Uh, hello everybody, my name is Amok and welcome to Heart of Little Boyfriend. And the last one we got Nageki. Uh, no, Nageki. Why do I keep saying Nageki? It's Ryota. That guy. Interesting enough, the only one with an orange eye. Is that symbol? No, it's probably not symbolism. It's probably just like the stock image. What is it, Tesla? Frank isn't over yet. Um, I wanted to talk to you, sir. Your friends are all here. Why not talk with them? Do you not want to talk to me? No, that's not what I meant. You're a funny girl. Snow, Tetsu, Do, Snow, Dirt, Dirt, Dirt. Wait, no, I haven't said anything yet. <laughs> well. I wonder if he has some sort of feelings. Oh my god, don't tell me he actually has an illness. Fucking with me. I don't want more sick people dying. Okay. Okay. I want to practice my Azami voice. Hey, hey you, hey you. I don't know you. Where did you come from? You ran all the way from there, you must be good. It's about a two hour drive from here. Hmm. I like the cut of your beard. Anyone that determined deserves a ride home. Come on. Koshiba mm. Zan. I sell takoyaki. Call me a zombie. Okay. Call me. Okay. Yay, I wanna get a job. Awesome. I'll get a job. Okay. It's beautiful in here. Oh my. Pardon me, miss, but we're not open yet. If you could come back at noon. Oh, sorry, I was here to ask about the job. The providers, the extremely hard to get I guess that's why they call mature attractiveness. He's a fancy way of saying he looks like I had, he's totally loaded. God. Uh, is that right? Forgive me. I'm called. Uh, here we go again. I'm gonna try and say it like nice and succinctly. Urichihara Kenzaburo. That actually worked really well. I am the owner of Torimi Cafe. I'm Tetsudo Hisakawa. Welcome, Miss Hisakawa. I hadn't expected a human. Um, are you going to interview me? I do not see any need to test such a wonderful young lady's desire to work here. And I believe you will be much more capable than I at moving the boxes of coffee and tea about. I'll be glad to. After all, I am a vitality girl. I shall be relying on you for this summer, then Miss Hezekawa. It is perhaps a little sudden, but could you start tomorrow? Of course. I'm glad. I shall be waiting for you here in my cage. Tomorrow then, Miss Hisakawa. <sighs> T 
Today is my first day work at Mr. Uh, Uru, Urushihara's Cafe. I think I'll leave early to make a good impression. Good morning, Miss Hisakawa. Good morning, sir. Let me start by showing you where everything is. I'm sure you'll be able to remember everything soon, so please ask if you can't find something. He shows me around the cafe, explaining everything inside. The shop is small and he keeps everything very tidy, so I'll be able to remember it all. Well then, what do you think? It's very nice, I almost want to move in. Come now, it's far too plain for a young lady such as yourself. Actually, compared to my how... And now it's Ryota. Excuse me. Um, I saw the f flyer at the station and... Ryota? Is a Kawa, what are you doing here? A friend of yours, Miss Isakawa. Oh yes, this is Ryota. You came for the job too, Ryota? Yeah, I saw the that it starts at noon, so I thought I could fit in after my other job. But you've already got the position, then that's that. Um, Mr. Uri Urushihara, could you use two people? Hmm. Sadly, my cage is too small to have that much work to do. I should. Fuck you, Ryota. I don't give a shit. Um, I'm sorry, Ryota, but I really want to do this. Don't worry about it, Hisakawa. I got a m couple more places to check. Perhaps some other time. I will be here if you are looking for something later on. I'll keep that in mind, sir. Have fun, Isakawa. Okay. Sweet. Almost opening time. I'm kind of nervous, but I'm not about to mess up after taking the job from Ryota. I wonder who will be the first customer. The first customer of my life will be. Ooh. Yeah, the new girl. A human. A butchery guard steps in the door. The first customer of my life, a young man who doesn't quite suit the atmosphere of the cafe. I was hoping for somebody who'd raise a few more flags. Maybe a white peacock. Welcome. Would you like a bath or a meal? Or maybe you'd like Mr. Urushihara. Wait, you'd like him? I don't want to think about what that means. I'll, I'll take Kanzaburo. Hey, wait a minute now. Yes, a perfect delayed reaction. Oh, hello there, Rabu. This is Rabu, Miss Hisakawa, a regular customer. I'm somewhat of an important figure here. See this card? 206 stamps. Amazing. Is he a cafe addict? Hey, what was the, what was, what was with that when I came in? I've been wanting to provoke that reaction out of someone with a Kansai accent ever since I was a little girl. I don't know what a Kansai accent is, too, so too bad. Thank you, Mr. Frabu. Thank you, my dream has come true, and I can die happy. Well, that's a little extreme. Y'all almost lost me on the roadside there. Well, that's how it is. Here's a cow, all right? That seat there is my private property. Y'all best keep off my private property. Y'all remember that now. This a new encounter in the little birdcage. Today is a good day. I shall make some coffee to celebrate. Please sit down, both of you. And so the three of us enjoyed an early afternoon pot of coffee. Wait, aren't I supposed to be working? Hmm. I stayed out of the out on the town too long and it's late. On my own, of course. Riding the stormy waves of a life alone is what we humans are all about. Okay, I have no idea what voice I'm supposed to do with this. A human. Oh, Jesus, it's actually a good match. What? 
Suddenly I'm surrounded by a bunch of unkempt pigeons. You go to St. Pigeonations, don't you? I bet a little rich girl like you gets a lot of pocket money from daddy, eh? Rich little girl going to a fancy school. Thinks she's so great. Oh no, it's the sandpaper music. That's only a bad thing. <laughs> Darn it, eh? I can't tell them apart. I can pick Ryota out of a crowd 80% of the time. But rock doves, I've met, all just look the same. Do you have some business with me? If not, go away. Well, that's not fair. Oh, well, that's not very nice. Show us some cash first. Cash. Okay. They buff up their... They buff up their chest threat... Wait, like buff, like buffing like a... Like a, like a floor? It's weird, okay. Dumb punks. Picking on girls in the park is a good way to get ostrich size for life. What? What? You little... They're angry now, mate. Hungry... <laughs> my hungry... My hunter-gatherer instincts can feel a fight coming. Three pigeons on my own, can I win this? Well, I mean, you can just kind of like roundhouse kick them in the face, so... <laughs> Slam. Thus. <laughs> the work of a moment. Some birdie flits for, uh, forward in the blink of my eye. The eye. <laughs> An eye. Somebody's eye blinks. And then they're knocked on the ground, twittering in surprise. What, they've got their phones out and they're on Twitter being like, Oh my god, someone just punched me. <laughs> it is. <gasps> Azami! That was close, here's a call off. Are you sure you should out be out this late? What the f- What the f- Who are you? Me. Oh god, I can't maintain the voice of me. Well, I'm a passing takoyaki lady. Takoyaki? Don't screw with us. They're stubborn, here they come. We're not gonna take this for a finch and an human. Take this. Yeah! This would be a lot more exciting if it wasn't in visual novel format. Not, not done yet, eh? Not done yet, huh? I don't know how to do this voice. Not done yet, eh? I'm gonna teach you chick kicks a lesson with my sparrow kick! So cool. Your sparrow kick is super cool, Azami. Don't relax just yet. This is where the real fight starts. Azami flaring my neck so under the glow of the neon lights and me playfully punching the daylight out of punctions. What the hell? Fighting back to back, now that's trust. Oh my god, love. Today's the local summer festival. I think I'll go with some birdie. Invite. Aw, can't we go with a zombie? Okay, so we are going to resume the rest of this in the next episode. Please subscribe and stuff. Yeah, and I'll see you a little later today. Bye.